Many hunters know from the changes in bag limits that scop are a species in decline. They've actually been declining. The population's been declining for many years now, almost 20 years of continuous decline. Um, the reasons for the decline are still up in the air, still being debated. Some folks think it's, it's poor winter habitat. Some folks argue that it's, it's staging habitat. For scop that go to the far north to breed, their, their primary breeding range is in that closed boreal forest that's in the northern part of Canada and, and Alaska. And so for them, the prairies are a staging area. And what a lot of female ducks do on staging areas is they build up their fat reserves. They're going to lay these very large clutches. They lay large eggs and then they lay about 10 of them. And so to do that, they use stored fat reserves. And for scop, they put on those fat reserves during migration. And so Al Afton and Mike Antu have suggested that, that uh, the, the staging areas in the prairies have fewer food resources for scop and that they're not able to get in great condition and so we get less breeding or, or a reduced breeding effort. Um, that's just one of the many hypotheses to explain uh, the decline of scop. Um, in some areas they're doing great. We have a site in North Dakota, which is really outside the typical breeding range for scop, but we have incredible scop densities. And that suggests that, well, if their nests are successful, then uh, they can home to the area and build up large populations. So in our area, we have a lot of scop right here in, in uh, eastern North Dakota on, on the Kandu block, but, but generally they've, they've declined a lot. The biggest decline is coming from the boreal forest. So, most of us think it's something on the breeding grounds. Uh, perhaps it's, it's greater predation, perhaps it's a change in, in uh, you've all heard of global warming and perhaps the ponds are warming up too early and the food resources are becoming abundant before the scop are actually out there nesting. Scop tend to be late nesters. Here on the prairies, mallards and pintails and even blue wings are shovelers are starting to nest, but scop will be another three weeks before they start nesting. So they're a late nester, nest in the high boreal forest by and large, and, and have been declining and are a species of, of concern for North American hunters.